you didn't know that you were at an event and not a tennis match. We are now seeing, even from a very early age in his life, Prince George supported by Princess Charlotte. Twenty twenty three was a big year for Prince George, Prince Charlotte, and Prince Louis, from performing royal duties at Grandpa's coronation. to cheering in the stands at Wimbledon. It's wonderful. To spreading Christmas cheer. Choose some presents for some children who were similar age to you guys. So if you think about yeah, this is a big All eyes were on 10 year old Prince George at King Charles third coronation as he helped carry his grandfather's robe into Westminster Abbey as a King's page. He was the youngest one, everyone else is teenagers, you know, he really took it seriously. You could see him sort of checking that every crease was outside of that robe. It's also a preview of what he may one day experience himself. Princess Charlotte had an important royal duty of her own, making sure her little bro Louis behaved. him by the hand and showed him what he needed to be doing. I mean, she's a pretty formidable little princess. She's the one that keeps him in line. I think it's sweet to be able to see that sort of sibling bond between the two. Yeah, five-year-old Louis was seen yawning and even disappeared at one point in the ceremony, but he was back with the fam on the balcony of Buckingham Palace, where he had this cheeky moment. Louis' two-handed waves on the on the balcony. What do yeah, you think of that? I think we're going to see lots of that in the years to come. And I guess I think the kind of parents that, that William and Kate are, they're not going to stifle that too much. You know, I think they're probably going to let him let him be, be his own person to a degree. But I think he'll certainly want to watch as, as the years develop. But back to Charlotte, the little princess was living her best life a day later at the coronation concert. And you're gonna hear me roar, than a I am a the eight year old was joined by her big brother George and their parents, along with the 20,000 people who attended the special event. Notably missing, the littlest Wells boy. Little Louis, he's only five and it's way past his bedtime, and he had a pretty busy day yesterday. The night was full of performances that got Charlotte and George on their feet. But the moment that got Charlotte most excited was when her dad, Prince William, took center stage. Please welcome to the Coronation Concert stage, His Royal Highness, the Prince of Wales. sort of mastered that sort of royal approach to public appearances at a really young age. Just two days after Grandpa's coronation, Prince Louis melted hearts at his first formal royal engagement with his family. Oh my goodness. You've made his day. You won't hear a beep out of him now. Louis stole the show at the Big Help Out, a day where people are encouraged to volunteer in their community. Kate is a patron of the Scout Association over here in the UK, and they took all three children to Slough, to a scouting centre. For Louis, this was his first public engagement. Now, Prince William didn't carry out public engagement until he was eight. For Louis, that meant helping his mom, Kate Middleton, with planting. riding an excavator with his dad, Prince William, and trying his hand at archery. But his favorite part appeared to be roasting marshmallows with his siblings. Prince Louis, I think he's gonna be a chip off the old block and be just like Harry. 
Mm. I think he's going to be a bit of a rebel. So I think he's going to be one to watch in the future. Fast forward to July, and Prince Louis was showing off his rebellious spirit at a royal air show visit. <laughs> The Wells family enjoyed a tour of the Royal International Air Tattoo, where Prince Louis had some strong opinions about the noise level. But just a few days later, eyes were back on Prince George and Princess Charlotte as they cheered in the stands at their Royal Wimbledon debut. An event, not a tennis match. We are now seeing, even from a very early age in his life, Prince George supported by Princess Charlotte. It's wonderful. The two eldest Welsh children joined mom and dad at the tournament and were totally invested in the game, sitting on the edge of their seats and sharing a glorious fist pump. You're seeing a support act here. You know, they, they've sort of stepped in on some high-profile roles. In the same way that William always had his wingman in, in Harry, I think it's rather wonderful that that is being echoed here with George and Charlotte. You know, you're going to see, I think, real teamwork at place here. After the game, they joined their parents for a royal meet and greet, chatting it up with the Wimbledon ball boys and ball girls, and even petting a police pup. William and Kate are very hands-on parents. They are incredibly relaxed um, and at ease. Which brings us to December, when the royal kids ended the year on a festive note, choosing their favorite toys to donate for Christmas. What we would like you to do is try and choose some presents for some children who are similar age to you guys. So if you think about what you would like to, to play with. Yep. The three kiddos and their mom paid a visit to Sebi's Corner, a UK-based charity that provides supplies to families in need, where they handpick toys to pack into Christmas gift bags. Here, there's lots of people who give out their time, and there are lots of volunteers who come and help out. And so you're the volunteers for this evening. We have seen far more of George, Charlotte and Louis in the past year than ever before, and that's no accident. And it is a very important image to protect for the monarchy, because this is the image of the future. In addition to toys, the young royals picked out books and clothes to include in the gifts. Princess Charlotte could be seen adding a handwritten note to one present. Earlier in December, the Princess of Wales hosted a special Christmas caroling event at Westminster Abbey. Her children? by her side as she greeted the clergymen and women, with George and Charlotte showing perfect royal behavior. But little Louis got up to his usual antics, blowing out his sister's candle during the service. Prince Louis is clearly a delightful character. He's full of energies, full of beans. He clearly finds these photo opportunities very exciting. I mean, it's an incredible thing to witness and I think you know, as far as the royal family is concerned, they adore him. They think he brings a lot of fun and a lot of charm to anything that he turns up at. I mean, those grandchildren are just adored. Earlier this month, the Wells family made waves with their annual Christmas card. And once again, Prince Louis was the focus of attention. A quick look at the card reveals what seems to be a Photoshop fail. Yeah, it almost appears as if Louis' left middle finger was digitally removed. But if you really inspect it, he's just stretching his hand across that armrest. No missing appendages here, just some Christmas cheer. Here's to 2024 and more viral moments from the royal children.